with Kay from Craft with Kay. How are we all doing? In the room with me is Captain Bimble. Bimble! And Pickle Pants. So, as you can see, I have a Timu. I've never used Timu before in my life. Um, I got an email asking if I wanted to join their affiliate program and stuff. And I was, I was on the fence. I was like, do I, don't I? And I thought, sod it, let's give it a try. So, I'm either going to continue with this or I won't. I have no idea. You guys will soon know once uh, if I post more stuff or not. So yeah, let's have a look see. I need to get some new scissors, I think. There we go. Right, so what goodies did I get? Got this, got this, got this, got this, and we got this. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five things. So let's start off with this. Something simple, uh, but I think it will come in very handy. This is a thimble. So as you should be able to see with the screenshot, they come in different colours. But I like the rainbow. Let's add some extra light here. It's just like metallic rainbow. And, oh, okay, I didn't actually know this about this. It's adjustable, so you can make it wider or smaller. You see how they are not connected there? So if you have a wider finger or less wide finger. Okay, that's cool. That's easy enough to move. So you can fit to any finger or thumb. But yeah, sometimes we uh, stitch, especially my partner. One second, guys. Sorry about that. Real life partner's phone started ringing. And I did think we all needed to hear his conversation. So as I was saying, with this... Because um, my partner rides motorbikes, leather is so hard to stitch through sometimes, and I was using whatever I could get my hands on to push the needle because it's too hard and I didn't have a thimble. So that's why I thought thimble. thimble. See, look, it's metallic. Thimble. It's metallic. It's the thimble. Rainbow metallic. So that is item number one. Well, right, item number two. <laughs> Let's do yeah. these. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Pickles item number one. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Great, now I've got to remember to bleep that at around 2 2.30. Yeah. So, comes with bog standard toolkit. One second, guys. Sorry about that. Right, so we have bog standard toolkit, pink pen, tray, and wax. And these are some more earrings. So, these are all the little hoops, hoopty hoops. And these ones are for Halloween. So yeah, you get a bunch of these. Which is good. And yeah. So let's have a look at these earrings, shall we? So these are Halloween themes. I love Halloween. Don't often dress up, but I do love Halloween. Woo! Wow. Okay. So we have got two little ghosties and they're double-sided. Just really, let's zoom you in a bit more. That might be a bit better. So we've got two little ghosts. One second. Sorry about that. Captain Bimble had a question for me. So as you can see, we've got two little ghosties and they are double sided. So let's see what space we got. Let's get ghosties. We have got. Ooh, dropped one. There we go. Called it. We've got spooky little castle mansion houses like Dracula House. Again, double sided. We've got. Witch's hat. We've got a moon with two bats in the background or in front of the moon. I like that we've got purple and a black one. We have got two little kitty cats. We have got two creepy spiders. I don't like spiders. They give me the heebie jeebies. We've got two spider webs. We have got Two crescent moons. Get out of the way, pumpkin. Might as well do these guys next. We've got two jack o' lanterns. And we've got two skulls. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten pairs of earrings. That's awesome. So, and we've got those bits to put them on. Let's have a look. Oh, oh wow, they're loose. Okay, so we've got two bags of black drills, three tenths. Then everything else is crystals. So we've got silver, 
uh, greyish, dark grey blue, gold, purple, red, this is a brown, got a greeny yellow, orange, I love that shade of orange, uh, a goldish and a pink. So yeah, I'm looking forward to doing these, I'll probably be wearing these actually, so like I said, I love Halloween. Let's pop these guys back in. Again, links for everything will be down in the description. So yeah, this is a Timu PR package, so never used them before. And this was basically, I picked out a bunch of different things. And they sent them to me to have a look at and review and put up on my Facebook. So yeah, links for everything will be down below. If I can collect all these little... I can't pick up the ghosty. There we go. Sweet! Right. So let's put these in here. I can't forget those. Kind of need those for them to work as earrings. So, we've got that. Where did I put that there? Okay, this is connected to earrings. I can find the end. Here we go. So I'm not going to get them all out because I'll never get them all back in. But I'll get one of each out. I didn't. I thought it was just going to be the uh, cardboard. I didn't realise we got these as well. Now I've got a whole bunch out. Okay. So these are jewellery little stand things. So just take that bit out and okay. 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 these. One needs ears. Well, it's indented, so you can just poke them out as and when you need to. Because not everyone has earrings. So, these are cardboard cutouts for like jewellery. So, you could hang a necklace or earrings or both or a bracelet or something. And I was not expecting these actually. I thought it was literally just the cardboard. So, that's actually pretty good. So, you can put that in and then you've got a nice little display. Which is pretty cool, because I'm doing the odd craft fairs here and there, and I thought that these might come in handy. So yeah, I didn't realise they came with this, I thought it was literally just this. So that's cool. Uh, so the jewellery doodads, I uh, don't know what you want to call them, but I'm calling them doodads. It would have been up on the screen what they're actually called. But there we go, pop that back in. So as you can see, you've got... A load of them and a baggie for each one so that's really good <clears throat> and a good way to store earrings so pickle pants if you got a hands on them wouldn't be able to get them out of the packet okay let's see let's go with this next so what is in this one it is coasters All right, there we go push that over there so got is that right? Yeah. So we have a uh, standard toolkit, wax, pen, and bow. We have our drills, and these are cupcakes. These are so cute, and you get a stand. Not all coasters come with stands, so I like it when they do. These are cupcakes. Cupcake coasters. So I thought that they were really cute. Lots of pinks. This one I like because it's got some blue. It's got cherry on top. Oh, I've got another two. Let's move up. Make sure you're still kind of somewhat in frame. Got that one and that one. Let's just zoom you out a smidge. There we go. So we've got two, four, six, eight, ten coasters with a coaster stand. And we have our drills. These look like they're all going to be crystals. I kind of don't want to get them out, so I don't think I'll get them back in. We've got pinks, reds, purples, greens. I love that teal blue. I love that orange, as I mentioned before. So I thought that these were really cute, and they'd be really fun to do. Because you don't often come across different shaped coasters. They're typically just bog standard round ones or something. So I thought that they were very cute. And put that over here. I always try to keep everything together. 
except for the toolkits. Toolkits I usually donate to my daughter's school along with spare drills so that they can use them with their arts and crafts. Now this one I'm excited to have a look-see at. It is again coasters. These look like a lot of fun. So again toolkit, so it's very consistent. Each one's come with the same sort of toolkit. We've got our colours, all crystals again. And this set is a retro set. Okay, so let me try and get these out. So we've got an old school box TV. We've got a boom box. We've got a roller skate. This is a skate, not blade. Blade is the one where they're all in a row. Blades are the ones where there's two in the front, two in the back. We have got... Honestly? Oh, okay, I know what it is. Rubik's Cube. It's a Rubik's Cube that's been turned. Oh, Rubik's Cube in there? Yeah. Wow. We've got a cassette. We've got camera. We've got headphones. Oh, there's headphones. And... He's sticking his tongue out of you. <laughs> so, these coasters have a foam thing attached to them. So, what the idea of these ones are, you peel back the plastic and you line it up. If I could pick it up. And then you stick it on. So, yeah, these are usually a little bit smaller than the actual coaster itself. So that you're less likely to overlap it. And it just... It's a little buffering, a bit softening, so when you put it down, it doesn't like scratch away at your table or anything. So yeah, each one comes with its own distinct cutout. So yeah, I've only uh, had coasters come with these once before. And they came out okay, actually, so yeah. And I just thought doing a retro set would be really cool. So sticking his tongue out of yeah. Yeah, let me know what you think. What is your favourite set? Because that is all I get from Timu. So all the information should have popped up on the screen as I was doing it. There we go. So yeah, I got five things. I got the retro set. I got the earrings. I got the cupcake set. The thimble. And the uh, jewellery stuff. So yeah, what was your favourite? Let me know in the comments down below. Like I say, links for everything will be in the description box. And let me know, what do you think? Yay or nay with Tumu? What's your opinions? Let me know in the comment section down below. Embrace the love, everyone, and have a lovely day. Bye, guys.